Hello and welcome to the session. In this session we discuss the following question which says if A, B, C, D are in continued proportion prove that A is to D is equal to A cube is to B cube. We know that when three quantities say A, B and C are in continued proportion then we say that A is to B is equal to B is to C. This is the key idea that we use for this question. Let's move on to the solution now. We are given that A, B, C and D are in continued proportion So therefore, this means that A upon B is equal to B upon C is equal to C upon D. We are supposed to prove that A is to D is equal to A cube is to B cube. That is, A upon D is equal to A cube upon B cube. First of all, we suppose let A upon D equal to B upon C is equal to C upon D be equal to K. Then this means that A is equal to BK, B is equal to CK and C is equal to DK. Now therefore, A is equal to in place of B, we put CK. So it is CK into K. That is equal to CK square. And in place of C, we put DK. So this is equal to DK into K square. That is, we get this is equal to DK cube. So we can say that A is equal to DK cube. Now, Next we have B is equal to CK and in place of C we put DK. So this is equal to DK into K that is DK square. Therefore we get that B is equal to DK square. Now first of all we would consider this LHS which is A upon D. So we have LHS is equal to A upon D. In place of A we put DK cube. So we have DK cube upon D. Now D cancels with D and we are left with K cube. Thus we have the LHS is equal to K cube. Next consider the RHS which is equal to A cube upon B cube. Now here in place of A we put DK cube. So DK cube the whole cube upon B cube and in place of B we put DK square. So DK square the whole cube. And so, this is further equal to d cube into k to the power 9 upon d cube into k to the power 6. d cube, d cube cancels and here we are left with k cube. So, we have the RHS is equal to k cube. Now, we got LHS also as k cube and RHS also as k cube. Thus, we have the LHS is equal to the RHS that is A upon D is equal to A cube upon B cube. Hence, we have proved that A is to D is equal to A cube is to B cube. This is what we were supposed to prove 
So this completes the session. Hope you have understood the solution of this question.